Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, The Soap Artist. This is Jennifer here. Today I thought I would make some soap dough pumpkins for you. This is a pretty simple variation. You can definitely add more detail if you want. But what I do is I start by conditioning some orange soap dough and then I simply roll it in a ball like you see here. I kind of flatten the top and the bottom out with my finger just by squishing it. Then I take one of my clay tools, which actually is very handy because on one side it has a little, as you saw, kind of cone shape top that allows me to put a hole in it. And on the other side it has this flat edge side which allows me to add little indentations all around the side to kind of create that pumpkin look. Now this is very basic and simple. You could definitely get more detailed if you wanted to when it came to shaping and sculpting the pumpkin. Next I take some brown soap dough, condition it, and I'm going to take a little bit and then I'm going to roll it into a thin kind of little, I guess, string of brown soap dough. You could always use an extruder and extrude it, but for what I was doing, making the little stems like this worked just well. I use that same tool and slice off a little piece and I'm going to stick it in the hole and I then will kind of gently close the hole up a little bit just to secure the stem in there. I will also usually tilt the stem over to the side because once the soap dough hardens, that stem could easily break off. So by folding it over, it just makes it a little more sturdy so that it won't break as easily. Now, I will also add leaves to these, um, but I do that with a piping tip and I do that once I place them on the soap, which you will see in the video coming this Saturday. 